justice shall flourish in the Lord's time and fullness of peace forever. Hello, and welcome to A Word of Hope on Tuesday of the first week of Advent. That refrain, justice shall flourish in the Lord's time and fullness of peace forever, is the refrain from today's responsorial psalm that is in response to the first reading from the prophet Isaiah. It's that very familiar reading where we hear God's word and God's mind that peace be established once again on the earth. Don't we need that today? Don't we need the establishment of that peace? And in that, we hear from the prophet Isaiah, when this happens, then the wolf shall be a guest of the lamb, and the leopard shall lie down with the kid. The calf and the young lion shall browse together with a little child to guide them. My friends, that's the season that we are in. And with this season comes the responsibility to be the people that try again to achieve God's dream for the world, that justice will flourish when God gets involved and the fullness of peace will reign when God gets involved. And as we celebrate that, as we wait for that, as we pray for that, as we listen for about, to the readings about that, we realize again and again and again that you and I are the ones who make it happen. Does this world not need the kind of peace that Isaiah's prophecy talks about, where the wolf and the lamb will be together, where the child will be able to put his hand in a cobra's den and nothing will happen to it? We are desperate for the message that Isaiah brought and for the truth that Jesus came to bring. We are not only desperate for it, you and I are the ones responsible for it. Let us pray on this second day of the first week of Advent that we do all we can to bring about the justice and peace of which we sing. God bless you all.